Peacekeeper's Homeworld. This looks to be very promising. Oh, shit. Okay, there we go. I was about to say, Spyro, speed up. Blue Hell, hopefully I don't die. Um, rendered outside walls. I can't tell if they're solid or not because I have to be on the inside to be able to tell that. Whoa. I just hope we find like something really cool that they didn't intend for us to see. Like an enemy that they placed as a placeholder outside the wall. Uh, that'd be awesome. Maybe a secret part of the level. That'd be cool. Uh, I doubt if they did it. I know that Super Mario Sunshine on the Nintendo GameCube actually has a Goomba. Uh, I believe it was an original Goomba that they placed. It might have been a Yoshi too, but I think it was a Goomba. That they placed at uh, Bowser's Theme Park um, in Super Mario Sunshine. Oh, shit. Whoa. Bowser's Theme Park. And it was underneath one of the merry-go-rounds, and it was really creepy to look at. But yeah, look at that. Wow. Things that... That was actually... That made it work. That was creepy, too. Didn't expect that. So, let's see what is above... If I can get... Spiral, get high. <sighs> Smoke more weed. Thank you. Oh, come on. Sp more weed, Spyro. Thank you. I'm going to try and get above this. There we go. There they go, 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 there they go. So, what we're seeing here are walls. Um, I want to see if the tips of them are solid. Because sometimes they'll make the bottom part where you can actually jump to um, solid. And the top part, they'll just crap out and they'll get lazy. Yep, see why I told you? The tips of it are not solid. That's cool. Going over this side this time. Pretty much just a clone of the other side. Going underneath the level because people really love doing that kind of thing. I don't know why. It looks cool, I guess. Uh, yeah, it does. It really does look cool. That's cool. So that's what the underneath the level looks like. It looks as big. It looks like two... Mm, no, never mind. It looks like one level. I was going to say two levels put together, but no, it looks like one level. A regular level and a portal. So that's all for um, the home world. I'm going to go to the other worlds now, the levels within. Inside of Clifftown right now, I don't know if there's going to be a lot of boundary breaking. There might be. But then again, this level, you get they let you explore so much of it. They let you explore so much of it in the level itself. From jumping from the highest point of the cliff. I mean, it's called Clifftown. Let's see if this is solid. Nice! V Spyro! Come on, Spyro. Don't have spasms. I'm only hitting it one time, and he's, he just keeps doing it. So that's solid. Probably means that the little one solid. Doesn't always necessarily mean that. But I'm not going to test it out because, like I said, limited amount of lives. There's the sun that's giving light to this level right over there. Going behind the level because that's what boundary breaking is for. Going out of bounds. Um, Not rendered. Not rendered entirely. Now I believe I am, yep, behind the uh, boundary that's going to do that weird thing. Cool, it's rendering still. Part of this is not going to be solid. There's a Mate painting, PNG image. That's awesome. I bet you all the way back there's not, but we're going to try it out. Let's see what happens if it does the same thing as Stonehill. Yep, pretty cool. Going above the boundary. Then gonna test out that. Woo! Yeah, so. Not entirely safe. Don't know if I can even go underneath the rest of the. Yeah, I can. Cool. Wow. Awesome. Yeah, well, there you go. Trying to get through these quickly, not waste your guys' time. But I keep dying. Spyro! Yeah, so this is probably solid too. Gonna try and land on it. Yes, it is. Cool. So, wow. That's awesome. Moon jump, Spyro. Come on. Smoke weed. Every day. Like Dr. Dre says. You fool. Dr. Dre's dead. So, yeah. That probably means those other ones are solid, too. Going under the level without... No, well, I can't go under the level, I guess. This one is just really, really picky. So, in short going to go behind the castle and then that'll be the last part of this level because like I said I'm trying to keep these really short underneath the castle it is 
yeah, I can't do it on this level. I'm sorry, but that's that's actually a good a good few finds though. So next level, Dry Canyon. Not one of my favorite levels. I I like remember nostalgia of being at my grandmother's playing this level at nighttime for hours. I don't know why. I just cannot stand the level now. At all glitchy background when you go too far. Um. Whoa! 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 Spyro! Spyro! God! Now this level's doing it too. Just randomly getting launched for no reason. Um. So I'm gonna have to fly a little bit higher, but that sucks because I can't render everything. The PS3 is not rendering at all. So there's part of that for some reason. You're legally allowed to go here in the game, so that's no fun. Boundary breaking is being illegal. Okay, so this right here. Spyro! Oh, 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 Spyro! Oh, God, that was my fault. That was my error. I'm going to run out of lives before I even finish this. Okay, don't fly over that. Dang it. I just want to see if it's solid. I'm getting a shadow. So it probably is solid over there. But I'm not going to die. There's the sun. The sunlight right there. That's, whoa. Whoa. Giving light to the level. That's solid. Spyro. Calm down. Uh, things to note are really nothing. There's really nothing to note other than that cool sun giving the level light. Do, 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 do. Whoa! So, that's all. Oh, wow! They can go really high. Spyro! Spyro! Jump! Okay, I'm gonna try and. Do, do, do. He wants some KFC, so I gave him KFC! Sorry about that. Don't know what happened. I didn't take my medicine today. Woo! Yeah! Okay. So, there's really nothing to boundary break. At least I can't boundary break it without dying. But we did get, we did learn some stuff from this level. Some. This level might be interesting because we are inside a cave. So, maybe we will... Holy shit, it turns out we weren't inside a cave after all. We were in an endless void that pretended to be a cave. So, what we learned from this level is quite a bit. I wonder if that's solid. That, yeah, that's solid because he, he just nicked it and then moved up a little bit. On the outside of the level, there are some kind of walls on the outside. It's just not rendering. Like, see, it's kind of disappearing. So, yeah, there are walls that are um, in the level outside of it. Right there. There's this disappearing whenever I fly near them. Uh, I'm going to go around the circumference of the level. Looks to be that the level extends outside just like Dark Hollow. There are um, tiles that extend outside the level itself. What else? whole bunch of those extender tiles. And I believe I've been around the whole level now almost one time. This is a big, big level. It may just be in a dome, but it is, it's pretty big. Like, wow. That's that's a really big level. Oh, God. I don't know what the hell happened there. I don't know why the camera keeps doing that. It's creepy. Um, up here. Curious. Spyro, just fly. Spyro, for the love of God. Okay, well, Spyro just doesn't want to obey me. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to fly under the level because, hey, look. There's nothing really hidden, or so it appears. I'm going to try and find that freaking... There it is. Okay. Can I... I can't land on you. Nope. That's a cool cinematic shot, though. Uh, uh. Now you do it, Spyro. Really? Now you do it, buddy. All right. Uh. 
I'm always no Spyro. You can fly. Spyro, fly! I just saw you fly. Okay. Last time. Eh. Fly higher and higher, Spyro. There's really nothing to this level. A lot of people are gonna complain and say, "Well, I'm making him too short." No, I'm not. Like, there's yeah, he he can't. Spyro. <laughs> God, there's really nothing to this level. We're moving on to the next one. One of the more weird levels from this game, Dr. Shemp. He's like a witch doctor who got really sunburned. Is morbidly obese. So, let's make magic happen. I always was curious about that thing over there. So, let me just get Spyro up a little higher. There's a um, rendered wall that just disappears. There's cool... Yep, solid. Flame just hit it. You can get over here in the regular game, so this is really nothing special. But yeah, see, there are rendered walls. For some reason, just whenever I get close, I guess the VRAM on the PlayStation 3 just does not want to... Oh, cool, we got to see some of these over here, too. Uh, does not want to... Um, what the hell? That made absolutely... Why did I just drop? That makes no sense. Okay, whatever. It's a sign that I should not be um, doing that. All right, so there's detail right up here on the castle. It's pretty cool. What the fuck, Spyro? Spyro! Why is he launching into the air like a cannonball? Really want to screw them all? Give me your dragon. Oh, it's not freaking solid. Dragon fly, Spyro. Your dragon fly. I guess I really can't show you the underneath of this level either. Dr. Shimp. Uh. Gotcha, B. Where, where'd Spyro go? He kept flying. <laughs> he kept flying. That was creepy. Spyro. Fly, man. Why do you sometimes fly? Sometimes you don't. Alright. I'm uh, going to see how close I can get before it actually kills me. No, I can't. I can't go into the level on this one. So, this is kind of a bummer. I can't go on, on under the level on most of these ones. There, it'd be really interesting to see, like I said, if there's anything hidden. Um, I think that's all for this level, which is okay, because the shorter the better. Honestly, there's no dawdling involved. I'm not seeing anything different, but I gotta say, the PS3 can load levels quickly. Like, parts of levels are really fast. Look at that. Boom, all those enemies. Well, bam. All at once. But, yeah. So, there's really nothing on this level. I thought there would be a lot more, but there's a Mate background, uh, PNG image, and I don't know where the sun is located. Probably right... Eh, no, that's not it. The sun that lights the level. Going on to the next one. To keep with the 100 percentile that I'm going for, I'll just freaking do this. I don't know why. I'll do it. Um, I need to find a place to land. And land safely, might I add. Before I can actually do anything out of the ordinary. So i got to find train tracks. Love the look of this level, by the way, uh, while we're waiting. Love the graphics for it. It's beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous graphics. Come on. Come on, where's the, the little... Isn't there like a train thing on this? Is there any place I can land? Right there. Or not. Spyro, you just don't want to obey me. I wouldn't want to obey me either. But still, come on Spyro. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Whoop. Alley-oop. We got a nice mate background. Beautiful moon someone made on a computer. Probably paint program. Looks awesome. He doesn't want to fly. Spyro! Spyro! Oh, God. This is why I don't want to do these levels. He just does not want to... He wants to... Spyro! Well, it doesn't look like there's anything really here. So, I'm just going to cut this level out. 